What's up, dudes and dudettes? All you awesome people! Welcome to the Geeky Heaven channel. I am Glenn, aka the Geeky Heaven, here with November's unboxing for Geek Gear. Oh, yes. I am excited for this box because November's box, I don't know it's December now. Description boxes, I'm going to say, they're all running late all year round, I think, now. <laughs> But this month's box for November, it's the Christmas special. I avoided all spoilers for this month's box. Uh, I know it's the, I'm sure they call it Christmas special or festivity special, but this month's box, the theme is Christmas. Because it's a Christmas special box, so I'm excited to see what's in it. It feels quite weighty. It feels like I've packed it quite well, so I'm hoping there's a lot of good stuff in here. So, those of you who are not aware of who Geek Gear are, Geek Gear are a awesome subscription box company and for a monthly recurring fee or recurring subscription, they will send straight to your door a box full of awesome geeky goodies, awesome items such as this amazing Walking Dead t-shirt. And my favourite item from last month's box, did you guess my favourite item? Well, a few of you did, guess my favourite item. My favourite item, guessed by Joshua M, who said, I'm going to have to pick the, I'll put it down here, Rick and Morty frame print. Uh, he did say frame print for this box because if he could, he would have picked the t-shirt. I've got to agree with you. That last month's box, the t-shirt probably is the best item. But favourite item apart from a t-shirt, because I always choose one apart from a t-shirt, I would have to go with the Rick and Morty frame print because it's really good. I still haven't took the cellophane off it because I'm still deciding where to put it. <laughs> but that's enough about last month's box. Let's open up this box, see what we got. Affiliate links, referral links, all that stuff in the description down below for you. Well, let's just crack the tab on this and see what we got. Once you open the box and move the tissue paper out of the way, this is what it's going to look like. that reindeer? Oh! Oh! I like that already. I, when I looked at the camera, I thought it was just like reindeer going across the, the moon. I was like, oh, it really is very Christmassy. Who's that Pokemon? <laughs> so, now what the t-shirt is. I like this. I haven't even seen all of it yet, but I can tell you I'm going to like it. Oh wow, I really like that. So that is a moon, and that is the free evolutions of Pikachu. I really like that. I like the way they've done it, as though they're on a... I can't tell, are they on a branch and then the moon shines in the background, or is it the moon setting and that's a little bit of a lake, a reflection? Either way, I really like that t-shirt. So that is a good start to this month's box. I haven't even seen this before. Okay. I'm getting too excited. I know. It's like it's Christmas already. But this is what I'm wearing at. Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 Metal Figs Group. I have not even seen one of these. Uh, I've seen Metal Figs. I've got a few Metal Figs. Uh, me thing of Metal Figs, these are really weighty. They're die cast, they are. So, Metal Figs M179 Group. Absolutely love this figure, and I'm going to take this out of the box and keep this on display out of the box. So, wow, it looks like there's tape all over the place. So, let's cut this open. I'm going to need the dragon sword. Okay, here he is out of the box. How amazing does this guy look! Oh wow, this is when they uh, were captive on the ship. This is, I absolutely love this figure. This is the best die cast or metal fig that I've seen. There's his head by the way. 
I absolutely love that. I think I already know what my favorite item in this box is gonna be. And like I say, it's so weighty. The weight of this is unbelievable. Come here, little group on my shoulder. Ooh, almost dropped him. Oh, I'm gonna find a safe place for him. He is absolutely amazing. But this box is still packed full of things. There's a card in here, so we've got the uh, cheat sheet. We'll leave that to the end, and we'll look through that, see if there's any varieties we could have got in the box, or any different ones everyone got. Let's see what this is. That looks like a Santa hat. I don't know what it is. It's very small. Let's get out of the cell phone. Don't worry, I'll recycle that later. It, what? <laughs> it's a Pokemon stocking. Right. <laughs> oh, it's got a little thing to hang it from. It's just a Pokeball, clearly. Pokemon symbol, colours, Pokemon stocking. That's absolutely amazing. I really like that as well. That's a nice little additional item. I like that. There, this, this box is still got quite a bit in it. So we've got another notebook because I think these subscription boxes don't think we have enough notebooks. <laughs> but this looks like a really nice one. So I can get it out. So much packaging to be recycled. Transformers Premium Notebook. As you see the outline of Optimus there. Uh, I'll take this. That will just slide straight out. A little badge that opens up. Let's see what's. Ooh, it's blue. The pages are blue. Oh no, they're not. They're plain pages. That oh, was a print on that side there. There is. Hold it this way because because of the lighting in here, I can't see it too well. They're plain pages. Um, there is. A transformer symbol in the bottom corner of the pages here. It's a bit too bright in here for you to see that. Hold it this way, you can see it. And so there's plain pages with a transformer symbol in the corner there. And a picture of Optimus, his head in lots of different positions. Same at the back. I wonder if this comes with no nothing in it. Normally these type of stick type of things are uh, published, distributed and licensed pyramid. I'm sure I've seen like Star Wars ones like this, and in the back, in this little flappy pouch, they have a few stickers, like Star Wars stickers. I'm sure I have. Uh, I don't know if it is, I don't doubt it is leather, but I think it's like leather effect, but that's a nice hard book notebook. Hard book? Hard? Yeah. Hard back, that's what I'm looking for. Hard back notebook. It's a nice notebook, as notebooks go. But let's move. Oh, wow. Chewbacca's Bandolier seatbelt cover. Yeah. Let's get this out of cell phone. This is going in my car. Oh, look at that. This is a bit that's sticking out here. Easy to install, padded lining, universal fit. That's what it says on the back there. Oh, wow. Let's see what this looks like out of the box, shall we? So many boxes in front of me now. I have to create some space if we keep unboxing things. So that's the size of it. On one side you have a bit of Velcro here and a bit of Velcro on the other side here. So that will go around your seat belt and Velcro onto it. So when you have your seat belt on, it looks like you've got Jimmy's bandolier on. This is absolutely amazing. A bit of ASMR for you as well. Yeah, there's a reason I do AS I don't do ASMR videos. That's I really like that. That's an awesome item. And then it looks like there's a couple more items in the bottom here. Looks like there's a, pr a print and there's a card. What a card! Crash a Bandicoot. Oh, this is so bright on here. That is. I don't even know what angle to hold it at to get it less bright for you because it's the white background as well. So it's Crash with Santa hat on and Santa beard and he's got a little present wrapped up there. It's got a little signature in the bottom here. Cantwell, so that must be the artist who's done this. I'm assuming this is going to be a blank card. It's got an envelope with it as well, so it's gonna be a blank inside card. A nice bit of artwork in the front of it. I'm probably gonna keep that, probably frame it or something, because I do like the artwork of that. 
that's very nice. And then, as usual, Geek Gear, give us a little print in the bottom. Oh, wow. Crash again. So, there's another one. Uh, oh, you got Aku there. So, you got Aku. Oh, Coco's there in the background as well. Got some gems. Crash himself. The colour scheme on this one's a bit. I'm not too keen on it myself. I would prefer it to be like the actual crash colours. Sort of like this. But, uh, that's just me. My preference. It is a nice print. That is, however, the end of the box. So, let's have a quick recap and remind myself of all these items we got. Guardians of the Galaxy, Volume 2, Diecast, Metal Figs, Groot, Pokemon, Evolutions of Pikachu, T-shirt, Transformers, A5 Notebook, <laughs> Chewbacca's Bandolier Seatbelt Cover, ignore my terrible impression, Chewie. I can't do a Chewbacca impression. Comment down below, let me know if you can do a good Chewbacca impression. I'd like to hear it. Crash Bandicoot card. Pokemon stocking. And Crash Bandicoot art print. That is a lot of items packed into a small box. I am really impressed with this. I'm really, really impressed with this group figure. Let's have a quick look at the card. See if there's any variants or any... Oh, oh there is variants straight away. So, exclusive festive stocking. Uh, exclusive greeting cards. There was Scottish artist Kevin Cantwell has outdone himself his quirky festive card design created for us. Included one of each designs and envelopes you to send on your nearest. Oh, one of each designs? There's more than one card in here. Let's open this up then. Let's have a look at this pack, shall we? <sighs> that was hard work getting into that. <laughs> so, right, so there is two envelopes and two cards. The one which we saw, of course. Crash himself, and then there is BB-8. That's really nice artwork. Artwork, I, I do like them. They are really, really nice cards. So we've got the cards. We've got the Chewbacca Bandolier seatbelt, license metal figs. You receive one of these four metal figs. Ah, so there's a lot of selections of the metal figs, as you can see, and it says that we will. You'll receive one of these licensed four inch metal figs. So we could have got, looking at this, quite a lot. Civil War, Doctor Strange, Street Fighter, Walking Dead, Harry Potter, Guardians of the Galaxy. There were some wrestling ones, Power Rangers. There was some Ghostbusters and other Guardians of the Galaxy. Wow, I think I've got the best one <laughs> out of it. Some of the other ones look really good. I'll probably have to look into these uh, metal figs again now. I haven't seen them for a long time, but I really like this. And the exclusive Crash Bandicoot print. Uh, Crash Bandicoot stencil design. We've included one of these designs, which we receive. So there's two different designs you could re receive there as well. The exclusive Evolution t shirt and the licensed Transformers Premium A5 notebook. That's a lot of items. Uh, shows you on here as well. Next month's box hint is Aquaman. And the YouTuber Spotlight, this month's featured YouTube channel is Muggle Magic. So, looks like an unboxing channel again. It looks like Wiz World of Wizardry unboxing again. Or Geek Gear Wizardry, it's called. I'm really impressed with this month's box. I know it's the festive box, and I think they have gone all out. But, comment down below, let me know what your favourite item is. Join me next month. I should reveal my favourite item for you. I've got a feeling I know what it is. I have a feeling you probably guess what my favourite item is from my reactions. You might be wrong. Who knows? Uh, if you're new here and you want to see more general unboxings by me or general geeky videos, why not subscribe down below? And whilst you're there, smash that bell icon so you'll be notified each and every time I upload. If you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't feel, enjoy this video, feel free to leave me a thumbs down. Now, I'm Geeky Heathen. Until next time, dudes. Take care. <laughs>